When lights go out You're in my mind I close my eyes So Rene! it's just you Rene, and I boy. Come on. And oh, I boy. tell Rene. myself hey, baby. You'll be back again When the stars are aligned we Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing really good. So I thought I would do a little day in life today. It's not going to be very exciting because I'm five days post op today of having my gallbladder out. Um, so I'm still I'm still recovering. I'm not doing a, a, a right lot really. Right lot, Saudi proper Yorkshire. Then. Not doing a right lot. Um, I'm not doing um, very much because um, I'm still just trying to rest as much as I can, as much as that's possible with three children. Then, yeah, we're trying our best. And Steve's not been feeling very well either. So, yeah, it's been very hard trying to rest and look after the kids and just, yeah, keep on top of everything because I'm not the type of person to sit still. I hate sitting still. I'm the worst patient ever, basically. Because I just like things done my own way. I just always want to like get things in a certain order. And yeah, so it's been very difficult for me to sit still, to be honest. But I've managed. I mean, I'm five days recovery now and I'm feeling good. Um, I'm still quite sore. I'm still a little bit swollen. But I'm definitely more mobile than I was a couple of days ago. So definitely feeling a lot more positive. Um... Cause I think day two was probably my worst day. I was at day three, one of the days, two or three, I was crying and I felt very emotional and a bit just lonely and yeah, a bit fed up. Um, but I'm bound to feel like that because it's a lot to go through. I didn't expect it to be as as hard as it was. I thought it was going to come out and be like, oh yeah, this is fine. I've got a couple of plasters on me. I'll be fine in a day or two. But is actually taking a lot longer to recover and I feel like I definitely wouldn't be able to drive yet I definitely wouldn't be able to go like on a, a walk yet um I still can't pick Roma up um I've tried and I definitely that was not a good idea because it hurt um so yeah I'm still I'm still just slowly recovering and trying to feel better um but today is a good day I feel like I'm I'm already feeling good because I've had a wash, I've got dressed, I'm not in just my PJs. I feel like I always have this jumper on though at the minute, it's my favourite. I just live in it. It's so comfortable, it's just cosy. So I've just got some leggings on which are really comfortable on my tummy because they're not like too tight. So I've pulled them really high up so they're all over my, um, my, my staples because I've got staples in my tummy. Awful. Dreading having them out. I'm having them out on Wednesday. Today's a Saturday. Um... So yeah, I've got staples because apparently the surgeon that did mine is really like old school. Quite a lot of people will probably do them, but he prefers to just do staples. So that's what I've got. So I have to have them out on Wednesday. I get to take my plasters off on Monday. So yeah, feeling good. Having another kind of chilled morning. I think I, think I might go out in the car with Steve this afternoon and the kids. We've got to drop Alfie off at his friends because he's having a sleepover tonight at his friends. Um, and then I might go out with Steve, Woody and Roma. He said to me, you can just stay at home, you know, but I don't know, I feel like I'm ready to, to venture out and go out. So we'll see how I feel this afternoon. But for now, I'm just having a little lie down on the bed because I've been up since, I think about 10 past six with Alfie and Roma. Um, because they were up first. And I let Steve just stay in bed a bit this morning because he's been coughing all night and doesn't feel great. So, um... Yeah, I'm I'm starting to feel tired now because I've been up for so long and done quite a bit this morning. So I'm just resting for a little bit on the bed and I will catch up with you all in a little bit. It's a watching a film and eating Easter eggs because it's obviously the start of the Easter holidays now. 
um, they're, they're off for two weeks. I'm just made, my, I, I can't even speak. I have just made myself a peppermint tea. I've been drinking these like crazy since I had my operation. Um, what have you got? Your suckies? You taking them off? Um, I've been drinking them like crazy since my operation because they're really good for like all the gas. Um, Mummy, put them on for you, sit down then. Because when you have the operation, they pump you full of gas um, to like blow your stomach up so they can see what they're doing when they're operating. Um, so this is like peppermint tea. Everyone was telling me like drink peppermint tea afterwards because it's really good for the gas pain because you feel like your body's full of gas, uh, which is not anymore now day five, but it's been helping loads and it just makes me feel better. And it's, I really actually like peppermint tea. So I made myself a cup of that. I'm going to go sit with the kids and watch a film. The playroom is looking lovely. Wonderful. Christ, giving me serious anxiety. It's been like this for about three days now. Bit of reality for you all. This is, this is my life. Excuse me, thank you for that. This is something she's got out of the cupboard. Should we go put this back? We don't want to spill it all everywhere, do we? Good girl. Are you reading? You love that book, don't you? It's such a cute book, this. It's got loads of um, like flaps in it so you can lift them up and see what's underneath. Look, what's under this one? The balloons. <gasps> More balloons! <gasps> and the babies! Hello, fresh oh. box has arrived. Uh, yeah. Now Alfie's <laughs> carrying it for me. Because Dad's upstairs at the minute. Hi. It's too heavy, it's got loads of food in it. It's way too heavy. Don't drop it. Rub my mouth. Oh, strong. Thank you to HelloFresh for sponsoring this part of today's video. We absolutely love it so much. It just makes our life so much easier and I thoroughly enjoy all the meals that we get to choose. There's something for everybody and there's always such a great choice. You can use my code and you'll get 60% off your first box and then 20% off your next two months worth of boxes and free gifts as well. So it's really worth checking out. So this week we have got this chicken stir fry, which is one of the Stacey Solomon um, ones that they brought out that she's just done like a collaboration with HelloFresh. So that is exciting. That is going to be delicious. It only takes 20 minutes as well. Um, then we've also got this fragrant chicken coconut curry, which is again only a quick one. It's 25 to 30 minutes, which looks amazing. I love all the curry ones that they do with HelloFresh. I feel like they're always really nice. And then we've also got this beef bowl. Um, I'm not even going to bul bulgo, bulgoey, bul <laughs> bulgoey. I don't even know how to pronounce it. I'm not even going to try. Well, I have tried and I don't think I'm saying it right. So yeah, it looks really nice anyway. And again, this is another quick one. This is only 20 minutes, which is perfect. Um, but I'm so happy that this has arrived because obviously me recovering and stuff, it just makes everything so much easier. You get your brown bags here that has everything in and like it's literally just been delivered to the door this morning. Um, so we've got all of our things in here. I'm gonna unbox everything, pop it all away where it needs to be and then we can make one of these later for our tea. But they look so, so good. Where have you been, Ronnie? Have you been playing out? Have you been looking for mice, probably? Romy, you look cute. Yeah. Have you got a new coat on? I like your new coat. Who got you that? Uh, uh, bye. Have you got a new coat? New trend. New trend. Alfie says this is a new trend. Yeah. Inside out coat. Mm. Up here for thinking. Down here for playing football. <laughs> it's actually up here for thinking, down there for dancing. That's the actual term for it. Please take your coat off, you look like a sausage. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Where are you going, Alf? I'm going to my friend's house. Ooh. Go sleep, Baba. <laughs> Are you a big boy now? Yeah, I'm, I'm ten. Technically. Yeah. You're grown up now, aren't you? I'm, I'm more grown up. Technically grown up now. I'm technically ten. Oh, we're all in the car now. That has really hurt my tummy now. I think I've done far too much already. So 
We won't be going very far when we get down into Skipton, I don't think, because my stomach well hurts now. And everyone keeps telling me, don't overdo it because you'll regret it and then you'll have to spend more time recovering. And I do keep like trying my best to not overdo it. But you know, we're here. Steve's brought all the snacks. Got all sorts. What have you got? I've got some oh, God. M10 taps. Okay. If you want to thread any holes. Oh, I've got some uh, roasted peanuts. Roasted peanuts. peanuts. Salted peanuts. Mini eggs. Mini eggs. Cookies. <sighs> I don't feel like that. I don't feel like I want any of them. Well, uh, I do. Hun. So you can eat them all. I will. Mm. I would happily gobble them all. No, I have no, no. zero appetite right now. To be honest. Oh, you sleepy girl. Mm. Oh. I knew you were gonna do that. <laughs> We've come to Sports Direct, haven't we? Please, can I get it? We want it? an Adidas t-shirt. Let's go look at the clothes, come on. Oh, okay. We've got loads of footballs. Yeah, but two are flat. Let's go choose a t-shirt, come on. Let's go find the kids over this way, look. I'll leave them. I did that. I did that. Keep going. Hey, look over here. Where? Here? Maybe. These are, these, these are the only ones that are that are Adidas like this, if that's what you want. Mm. Do you just want everything that you see? Yes. Well, we're back in the car now after Woody's little shopping trip. Asking for everything that he saw in Sports Direct. Hiya! 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 Not yet. Okay. We have just got back from our day being out, haven't we? Oh no, I think we have to try them. And we're going to try these. Oh yeah. Because they they're really nice now, they're chocolate. Oh god. I keep seeing people using, heating them, they're only... 83 calories and they're like strawberries with like coated in chocolate in the frozen part of um, Tesco I got them from. Um, they do like blueberry ones and pineapple ones but they only have the strawberry ones so we're gonna test them. I did one for you. Seriously? One for me, cheers. Oh, I can't bite it. Mm. Oh, oh, well, good. Yeah, those strawberries have mine's just come totally out. The strawberries are right. Oh, mmm, they're really nice. Basically, just like melted chocolate on the strawberry. You like it? Uh-huh. Strawberry is very cold. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Five caramel. Five caramel. No strawberry. Mmm. I don't want the strawberry. I go. I'm gonna go give one to dad. Yeah. I don't want that. Let's sit. My boss sit. Boss can sit. Let him. Oscar. Sit. Oh. Sit. Paw. Paw. Good boy. Clever. 